Today we are going to answer the question, what is the difference between a polarized and a grounded plug-in timer? Welcome back, my name is Jamie and I'm the Social Media Manager here at GlobalElectricalSupply.com. Today I'm going to answer the question, what is the difference between a polarized and grounded plug-in timer? Well, first we're going to talk about electrical cords. There are two main types of electrical cords, polarized and grounded. A polarized cord will have a male end with two tines or prongs. These are generally found on lamps or Christmas lights. A grounded electrical cord will have a male end with three tines or prongs, with the third being the grounding node. These are typically found on cords such as kitchen appliances and extension cords. The grounding node is there to help guard against electrical shock. So how does all this play into timers? Well, timers have a female end that can either be polarized or grounded. Timers such as the Torque 401A and Torque 403A have polarized female outlets. Timers such as the Torque 402A and Torque 405A have grounded female outlets. Which one you choose depends on what type of cord you will use to plug into the timer. Now, a polarized or two-prong cord can always be plugged into a grounded or three-prong timer. So if you're looking for a multi-use timer, go with the one that has a grounded outlet. Otherwise, choose the one that works best for your usage. As always, if you have any questions, feel free to click on our chat button on our website or give us a call at 877-464-9985, Monday through Friday, 8 a.m. to 5 p.m. Eastern Standard Time. What is your favorite plug-in timer? We want to know which one and why. Leave your answers in the comment section below. If you found this video helpful, be sure to subscribe to our YouTube channel. Thanks for watching. Until next time.